In Photoshop, CS5, CS4, etc., PC or Mac, you can change the color of a gradient. Now, I'm just going to go to the gradient tool. Got a selection of gradients here. They're from graphicextras.com. Of course, you could use any other gradients. These are pack three designs, complement colored ones. So I'm just going to select a design and I can just apply the color. So I'm just going to quickly apply that using the linear option. So it just applies it like that. Now I can change it via the stops. So I can just go and change the color there if I wish. Just make it a different color. But I can also just apply a simple adjustment. So image adjustments and then hue saturation. I can modify that there and change the color of the gradient. I can also go to the layers and I can go to the just down here and add an adjustment layer, hue, saturation. And I'm just going to quickly show the effect. Just bring up the palette there. So I can just change it there. Now, the underlying gradient is still the same, but you've just got an adjustment layer on top. So you can basically modify it to your heart's content, but the still the underlying design is still unaffected. Right, there's other ways to do it. You could use various plugins and filters, but they're the basic steps of changing the color of a gradient. Of course, you can go via other commands as well. I'm just going to quickly get rid of that uh, adjustment. Right, and you can go to image adjustments. Of course, you can go to any of these other options, color balance or black and white. You can go and turn the gradient into a black and white and by changing the various strength of the red or yellow, you can create unusual black and white, or grayscale anyway, gradients. Of course, you can change the color, go into different color modes as well. It's another option. And there are also, of course, presets for the adjustments as well. So you can change them quickly there. Just going to quickly go back. And another option, probably a nicer one, is adjustment and go to the photo filter and you can change the warmth or cooling factor to the gradient. So you can make a slightly cooler gradient that way. So that's simple, easy ways of changing the color of the gradient.